Maybe you already know the term Feynman method from the series Big Bang Theory. However, this is not only fictitiously applicable, but can also help us learn in reality. The Feynman method says that you learn up to four times faster with it. The subject matter is not learned by heart, but understood down to the smallest detail. We explain how this method works and how you can use it. Therefore, be sure to watch this video until the end, so that you too can learn much faster in the future. How does the Feynman method work? Richard Feynman was the son of physicists and a true genius. To understand how his method works, you must first be able to differentiate between the different types of knowledge. On the one hand there is the superficial knowledge. This makes it difficult for us to understand a subject, because we have only internalized the technical terms and have not mastered the material. On the other hand, there is the deep knowledge and understanding. If you reach this level, then you have completely understood the subject matter. You can deduce things from what you have learned, such as the fact that fire is hot. This knowledge then gives you the ability to answer transfer questions. These are the questions that make us feel like we're being asked about knowledge we don't have on an exam or test. Feynman formed a learning group with colleagues at that time. They were supposed to convey a topic to the participants in an understandable way. The special thing about this was that no participant was allowed to use technical terms or foreign words and had to try to explain the topic completely. This is an art in itself and not at all as easy as one might think. The Feynman method enhances our understanding and also qualifies us to understand and answer transfer tasks. In the following we will tell you the four steps of the Feynman method. The special thing about them is that you do not apply them only once, but they form a circle. After you have applied the last step, you start again from the beginning. This way you can check if you really understood the topic. We will now show you the individual steps for this. Number 1. Explain the topic completely. When starting a new topic, first get an overview of your current knowledge. You do this by explaining the topic to the person you are talking to. It would be best if the person you are talking to has no prior knowledge about the topic. This way you would have to explain everything in detail and it would be easier for you to find out where you still lack some knowledge. Number 2. Let the missing knowledge. Through the first step you could determine which topics and aspects you do not yet understand. Because what you can't explain, you can't understand. You should make a note of these topics so that you can start there later. You can replace foreign words and technical terms with simpler words that you are familiar with. Number 3. Close your knowledge gaps. Look up the technical terms or topics that you did not understand. This can be done easily if you have made notes in advance, as mentioned in step number 2. In particular, you should make sure that you replace technical terms with simpler words. If necessary, examples from your everyday life can also help you to remember these topics better. Number 4. Explain the topic completely. At this point you are back at step 1, since the Feynman method, as already mentioned, forms a circle. You now check if your research was successful and if you understood the topic. Repeat this circle until you can explain the topic without any problems. The Feynman method helps not only in relation to current topics, but also to deepen existing knowledge. Facts can be learned faster and it is not a dull memorization. This method is more about the actual understanding and penetration of the facts. If you want to learn more interesting learning methods, you should definitely watch the video that we have linked to you here in the video. There we show you 6 simple learning methods, for even easier learning. If you liked the video then I would be really happy about a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any new video.